Crazy for the Storm, a memoir of survival, by Norman Allestad is a gripping and poignant autobiographical account of the author's harrowing experience surviving a plane crash in the California mountains as a young boy, interwoven with his relationship with his father. Through vivid storytelling and vivid descriptions, Allestad paints a vivid picture of his extraordinary journey from the wreckage of a crashed plane to finding the strength and determination to survive against all odds. The narrative is divided into two timelines, skillfully intertwined throughout the book. The first timeline recounts the events leading up to and following the plane crash. Allestad, just eleven years old at the time, was traveling with his father, who was a skilled outdoorsman and pushed young Norman to excel in various sports and activities. This early exposure to a rugged and adventurous lifestyle sets the stage for the challenges he would later face. The crash itself is described with vivid and terrifying detail, immersing the reader in the chaos and panic of the moment. The second timeline takes us back in time to Norman's childhood, providing insight into the unique and often demanding relationship he shared with his father. Allestad's father, a charismatic but somewhat reckless figure, becomes a central character in the narrative. He instills in Norman a love for adventure, a competitive spirit, and a relentless drive to succeed in everything he does. The author's portrayal of his father is complex, he is both an inspiration and a source of pressure and anxiety for young Norman. This duality adds depth to the story and explores the complex dynamics of a father-son relationship. Throughout the memoir, Norman Allestad's writing is both evocative and reflective. His descriptions of the natural landscapes, particularly the California mountains where the crash occurred, are vivid and immersive. Readers can almost feel the biting cold of the snow, the sharpness of the jagged rocks, and the isolation of the wilderness. These descriptions not only serve to set the scene but also reflect the author's deep connection to nature, instilled in him by his father. One of the most striking aspects of Crazy for the Storm is the resilience displayed by young Norman in the face of adversity. After the crash, he finds himself alone, injured, and faced with the daunting task of descending the treacherous mountain terrain to seek help. His survival instincts kick in as he draws on the lessons and skills his father had imparted to him over the years. His resourcefulness and determination are nothing short of remarkable as he navigates the perilous journey down the mountain. The book also delves into themes of grief and loss, as Allestad grapples with the tragic death of his father, who did not survive the plane crash. This loss is profoundly felt throughout the narrative, and Norman's emotional journey is depicted with honesty and vulnerability. His father's absence is keenly felt, and it serves as a catalyst for his own self-discovery and coming of age. Moreover, Crazy for the Storm is a story of resilience and the indomitable human spirit. Norman Allestad's ability to survive against all odds is a testament to the strength of the human will. His memoir inspires readers to reflect on their own capacity for resilience in the face of adversity. In conclusion, Crazy for the Storm, a memoir of survival, is a captivating and emotionally charged memoir that combines elements of adventure, tragedy, and personal growth. Norman Allestad's skillful storytelling and poignant reflection make this a compelling read. The dual narrative structure, vivid descriptions, and exploration of the father-son relationship add depth and complexity to the narrative. Ultimately, this memoir is a testament to the enduring power of the human spirit and the ability to find strength in the most challenging of circumstances. It is a story that lingers in the mind long after the final page is turned, leaving readers with a profound appreciation for the resilience of the human heart.